I was working uh, with this script for some years, and uh, you know, uh, and then uh, and it was a, a little bit, you know, passing over to English. And then uh, me and Alicia had lunch, and I was telling her about the the story, and she read the script, and she was kind of, you know, shouldn't we do it in English instead? So in the beginning, I was like, no, <laughs> because for me it was a big step to change the language. Lisa introduced her idea just felt like a natural um, choice to, to, to take that step and let this be my first um, opportunity to produce and she already had Be Real and Swedish production company on and, and then I was able to kind of step in and hopefully help Lisa to get her first film to get out to an, more of an international audience in English language. It's a story about two sisters that had a uh, um, tough uh, childhood and Try, they find out two different ways to deal with the pain, inner pain, and that made them become very different as persons. So this, now when they're grown up, they try to, you know, get together and sort things out. It's a film about freedom and also about responsibility. How much can you require from another person in terms of also how much can you require, require for someone that's family member? Yes, because it's family. And it raises questions about where's the line between your responsibility for your own happiness? I'm very curious in how you can grow up in a family uh, with someone that you so closely related to and how you can go on very different paths and have very different choices and, and take very different um, take hold of different opportunities in life and, and then how you kind of both maybe struggle because you have you feel a responsibility to have a very close connection and you kind of already do because you've shared memories from a very early stage in your life um, and, and can you actually choose to have a tight relationship just because you are family or is that a choice? Um, and I think that was something that I was very attracted to. With this film, I, I think that Rob Hardy, our DP that I've worked with before, has an in incredible eye, and I, I think our film is very, you know, beautifully cinematic. So um, if you get the chance to see it on the big screen, I would definitely always recommend you to do that.